Greetings and welcome to another episode of Trippy Food. We're once again joined by Julie Coots. Julie, we are uh, neither one of us are really uh, excited about this, but we're going to try this anyways. We have two, uh, I guess, candy drinks. Yeah. Uh, they're iced coffee. They're apparently by Victor Allen's. Do you know who Victor Allen is? No idea. I do not either. But these are apparently from Victor Allen's, and one is Twix flavored, and one is Snickers flavored. So. I'm thinking that they're going to be kind of like the Starbucks drinks, where I'm they're, they're just super the sweet and chocolatey and crap. I have a feeling they're going to taste exactly oh, the same. Shake them up. Yeah, shake look them at up. the ingredients. Are they all the same? Yes. I think they're going to taste. Uh, that one has sea salt. Oh, okay. Oh, which is me. which is weird because this one should because this is the one with the peanuts. Oh, uh, but the, but you know what? Okay, I am going to say this: they are iced coffee drinks, and they do have coffee in them. So it's not just gonna taste like like the um, it's not just gonna taste like the candy bar with milk. I still think it's probably done a little bit. This is an odd visual here. <laughs> <laughs> Julie, I'm gonna let you pick which one you would like to open. Uh, let's do the Twix first because maybe it's a little less there's less going on. Twix it is. Might as well open this. Yeah. Get it ready for a big debut. Oh, it looks kind of weird. It doesn't look like like a latte or anything. That's not. It doesn't call it a latte. Right? It smells very caramel and oh, it does. Artificial uh, coffee smell. Mm. Well, I mean, artificial drinky smell. Mm, it's really caramel heavy. Mm -hmm. Really caramel heavy. I mean, does it taste like Twix? It doesn't have that like cookie and not super chocolatey. Tastes like, very a caramel, caramel. tastes like a caramel latte. Caramel latte, exactly. Like a Starbucks caramel latte drink. But I have a feeling this one's going to taste different. I think this one's probably going to taste like a caramel latte. <laughs> mm. I think this one's going to taste like a mocha it latte. It looks different. It's a little redder. Yeah. Mm. This one's going to be like a mocha latte, I think. Mocha chocolate, mm -hmm. whatever. Oh, God, that's so sweet. I like it better, though. I like it better. That's it is because you sweet. hate caramel, also. This has caramel in it. But it's way less caramel. Oh, than yeah, that. yeah, yeah. This should have peanuts in it, and it doesn't. Be no, seriously, look no, at I know, there's I know. No peanuts There's no Well, that's why I said it's weird, because this one has sea salt, and that one doesn't, but you would think that the sea salt would be in the Snickers one. How, but how, how do you do a Snickers-flavored drink without peanut flavor? How do you do that? I mean... It's easy. You just mix, mix some peanut butter in there, right? But there's no peanuts in the ingredients here. Nope. Um, bizarre. That's bizarre. So yeah, so these taste a little bit different. This one's a little bit sweeter. Um, I, I like this one a little bit better, but um, if we're judging by how closely this one comes to Snickers and that one comes to Twix, then it's gonna get a low rating. Uh, and, and the question is, is it worth it? Is it worth it in the long run? I will say, anybody that really likes the, um, they even look like them though, the Starbucks drinks. If you like the Starbucks Frappuccino bottle drinks, then you'll like these. I think you'll really enjoy these. I don't, I like black coffee personally, so I also don't think that they hit the mark as far as this tasting like Twix and that tasting like Snickers. Not at all. And I would for say those reasons, in the middle, maybe? I'm giving them thumbs down only no. because I don't think it hits any any real marks. It's just a sweet coffee drink. All right, they're not terrible, so I can't give them a, to a total thumbs down. But they don't hit the mark on the candy on the candy bar thing, which we normally give them a thumbs in the middle. But there's nothing, you know, it doesn't add anything. It doesn't bring anything to the table. So for me, it's a thumbs down, trending upward. Yeah. And there we go. So if you want to try these at Walmart, we've got these. Mm -hmm. I think Wally Walmart. Walmart. Uh, so you'll probably be able to get these. I have a feeling they'll be around for a while. And they'll uh, just probably come out with equally awful flavors. Yeah, they're not. That they they're not. Do. They're not great. But you know, you're just going by how, by our taste buds. Yours might be a little bit different. So leave a comment down below if you've tried these and you've got a different take than than we did. We'd be interested in that to see. But when you do get out there to get these, just remember that it's crazy out there. So please be careful. Take care of yourselves. Take care of others. And we'll see you soon. Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. 
Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.